My name's David Richards. My name's Nikki Brown. My name is Trisha Baldwin. Sue Munson. John Nugent. Susie Lidstone. Kaya Bello. Tim Sutton. Claire Grossman. And Tim Southall. Harfield. Harfield. My name is Kirill Katarov and I'm coming from Bulgaria. Somewhere else that. Uh, Guernsey. Hampton. Twickenham. Lower Sunbury. From Deal in Kent, so... Ely. Farnham. Brixton. North London. And Spain. I'm showing here a few different projects. Uh, so um, the main inspiration to be here is uh, to show uh, to the new audience, to the people of London, uh, the, the art I made the uh, last 10 years. I'm making two sorts of ceramics. I concentrate on smoke-fired ware and also stoneware. The stoneware will be used in the kitchen and on the table, whereas the smokeware is more for looking at and enjoying. The smokeware in particular is quite exciting because it's fired in sawdust and I wrap various items around the pottery, seaweed, strings, wires, dead leaves, that sort of thing and then mixed with the wood from the sawdust then you get various oils and resins that will burn and give me the colours on those pots. My inspiration was um, lino cutting which I adore. I love the process, I'm really thrilled when I pull the first print, but I also have to draw in order to do the lino cut. So in the last couple of years I've done a lot more drawing. It's more immediate, uh, you can get a result very quickly. I only learnt to paint after I'd retired, all sorts of things, because I do not like to get bogged down in the same stereotyped. I take most of my shots from about four feet away um, from the boats uh, with my wellingtons on generally mm -hmm. standing about a foot deep in mud. <laughs> it's water. I mean um, if you look at one of my collections it's from the inspiration is from bubbles and raindrops really so everything around me um, I love water so that's what I've used for my inspiration. Can't you tell? Flowers. <laughs> Colour. I love the urban scene, I love street art. I go into London, I know what's going on. And I just think that to bring it out to the suburbs, I'm finding younger people love it, it resonates with them. So, yeah. Plants and flowers. I took, really love Charles Henry Mackintosh's flowers and also his architecture as well. Um, Paul Hogarth. Um, that's about it, really. And me. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> Which sounds a bit dark. Yeah. Doesn't it? Paintings of paintings and prints. Um, pets and people. Flesh and fur. Pine trees and with the figure. Animals in the landscape and uh, capturing a sense of place in the landscape. It's my first time exhibiting here at the Landmark Centre and I sold a couple of pieces so that made it, made it all worthwhile. So. I find it's a lovely place for selling my work. I love coming here because I feel it's a very well organised show. So I love the Landmark Art Centre. I love it, it's a great venue. I love it at the Landmark, it's been a great atmosphere. Yes I love it, this is my third year. The people are all very supportive of one another. The stands are well laid out, it's quite reasonably priced which always helps. To talk to customers direct has been, yeah, it's been a positive experience, yeah. Yeah, it's good. It's about the sixth one I've done. Cakes. The cake is very good. For me, it has everything. 